Good morning to many, good afternoon, and good evening from Zurich, Switzerland. This is the Apostle once again. I'm reading a statement from Mark J. Golden. A statement on oil edge tax. In 2015, at a time when the world was enjoying a temporary dip in oil prices, the PMP administration considered it prudent to begin purchasing insurance to protect the country against risk of world oil prices once again rising to an affordable level. That insurance was the oil price edge, and it was paid for by a tax of five Jamaican dollars per liter on petrol. The world oil price is now higher than the price which would have triggered payment to Jamaica under the insurance purchase in 2015. But Jamaica has nothing to get because the country is now unprotected. The JLP government having abandoned the insurance when they came to power. Although the JLP government has abandoned the purpose of the tax, they have not rolled back the tax. At the same time, the oil price have gone up. As a result, the price of gas at the pump is now the highest it has ever been. Indeed, nearly 40% of the Jamaican, 40, go again, nearly 40% of the price Jamaica now pay for gas is in fact tax. The oil edge tax was specifically to pay for insurance for the country. Jamaicans are saying that it is ethical unethical for this tax to be used for other purpose. Leaving the country unprotected as oil price rise while Jamaican have to pay more than ever before. The impact of the tax is dramatic. For example, in 2013 when oil was US $100 per barrel, Jamaicans were paying 112 Jamaican dollars per liter for gas. In contrast with oil now at US $65 per barrel, Jamaicans are now paying 140 Jamaican dollar per liter. Gas at the pump is much higher, even though oil is much lower. The finance minister has said that now is not the time to roll back the gas tax. It is indeed for important public investment and social spending. The opposition say that he could equally have said that the tax is paying for the ever increasing list of scandal plaguing the JLP government, including debushing to fight local il elections, used cars that have not delivered to, to the police, a massive overrun in building a wall at Petrojam. Having left the country unprotected, the, Jam the JLP government has no moral authority to insist on retaining the oil edge tax. The tax is now a symbol of the unfairness of the heavy burden Jamaicans are being made to bear. The government must listen to the people. He stated, one love. Well, 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 you see how the corruption is going on. The government is doing corruption. The oil was, was paid for because they had bought enough barrels of oil. Now when the, this party came into power, they don't bother again with the protection tax. Now they are, it seems they are pumping now the people that they would pay more money for their mistakes, even though the gas price is low. 
I leave this to you, my Jamaican folks, to share your views and check it out. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. You be blessed.